Hello everybody and welcome back to the Chariot series of myself, Crystal Rocket, for the last of the Summoner videos. Here we are with the Thor Hotel. Or the H variants. We all know what H variants mean for the clanners. It means heavy lasers. Yeah, that's right. So this is a pretty straightforward build, as all the Thor and Summoner models are. It's two heavy large and two ER medium lasers with an AMS system and the obvious jump jets, and a nice targeting computer to boot, though it doesn't specify the size of the targeting computer because uh, MechWarrior Lang uh, kind of, I think MechWarrior Lang kind of messed with it. Targeting computers generally in tabletop were uh, a system that just essentially allowed you to do uh, cold shots outside of the head, uh, for instance, so uh, normally when a mech uh, is knocked over, you can do a cold shot, you can like, oh, I mean, for the, the arm, the leg, the side torso, whatever. Makes it slightly more difficult, but if you succeed, all your hits go there. The clan's targeting computer basically allowed them to do that before a mech had hit the ground. So, this is one of the things that made mechs like the Warhawk so deadly, is its uh, PPC setup meant it could just fire, like, two or three of its ER PPCs into a leg, uh, or a side torso, and probably rip the whole thing off. Made it more deadly than the direwolf in that regard. So, yeah, obviously in Mechwarrior Line you can't do that, so they, they smartly redesigned it around the idea of it being something that gave you a kind of uh, a set of passive buffs for the weapon system. And it's pretty good. But, uh, yeah, uh, Mechwarrior Online's uh, version of the Summoner, unfortunately, uh, as I've mentioned, suffers from a hell of a lot of LSAS. Low slung arm syndrome is the big killer of this poor boy. Uh, unfortunately, being all the weapons are, are in the arms, it means that unless you're on a very open area of the map, the mech does somewhat struggle. Heavy lasers are an issue to begin with. Uh, I'm not the biggest proponent of them. I see the benefit of them, and on the right build, these things can be deadly, but yeah, um, it, it, it just doesn't work, unfortunately. The, the weapons, the, the two heavy large lasers are, are too hot, take too long to cycle, and the cycle time on the ER mediums isn't great either, so that the mech essentially struggles uh, to do any major damage, and once you get to the point like, where I am now for instance, my left arm is now getting to the point where it's virtually useless, like I can't shoot any targets at this point, um, because of the angle of the arms compared to the ground, and this is one of the troubles that I have with it. Plus, firing both of them at the same time, the heavy ladder, is it's just not viable without putting on a hell of a lot more heat sinks, which only mechs struggle to do. And yeah, overall, your maximum potential damage is slashed. Compared to the ATM version with the Echo, or even the Alpha version of its Gauss Rifle and Large Pulse Laser, damage potential is on paper quite high, but in practice, very, very low. And realistically, I couldn't ever really recommend using this build or this model of the summoner. It just, it just isn't very good, unfortunately. Uh, usually, the heavy variants for me or the heavy laser variants have worked okay. Uh, you know, looking back at things like the linebacker, for instance, uh, amongst others. But uh, yeah, it just doesn't work for this this thing. It it doesn't really have the speed to be able to quickly maneuver away. Uh, even though 81 kph isn't a bad speed at, at any rate, uh, it's a very tall Omnimac. Uh, so unlike, say, the linebacker, which does have a higher speed and the ability that's to use the terrain a bit easier for cover, it uh, really does struggle uh, to evade uh, return fire. And at this point, the, the map's already a bit of a bit of a dud. And as I said, because of my relatively low rate of fire, I can't assist as much as uh, as I could say with the ATM build where I can get a lock and I can semi keep up a certain regular amount of fire, even the ERPPC would help, uh, or the Alpha, or any of the other standard versions that are in the game. So, yeah, I wouldn't recommend this, unfortunately. Uh, it's not to say it's a dud ending uh, for the Summoner, I still think it's got some blinding variants. It's a very fun build, uh, sorry, a very fun Omnimech to try out if you haven't. It's had a bit of a bad rap. Uh, over its lifespan in Mechwarrior Line, not many people like it. Um, you know, it's not a huge uh, sort of swell of support for this mech uh, when it initially came out. I think that this and the Adder were two of the Omni mechs that were kind of, kind of derided by the by the player base. Uh, I mean, as I said, the the 
the adder, as I've mentioned before, was known as the badder. And, um, yeah, the, uh, the, the, the summoner was usually just laughter. I, I remember, uh, when I was, when I was first sort of taking the summoner out for a spin when it was first released, and people used to just say, like, why? they type in chat, why? Why, why are you in the summoner? And I'd just be like, yeah, oh, because I, I like it, I like the build. Um, and you would, you would just get people go, ah, oh, oh, no, it sucks. It's like, it's a bad Omni mech. I'm sure now maybe perceptions are different with new mechs coming in, maybe different weapon systems like the uh, ATMs, maybe gave it a new lease of life for those people who stuck with it. But yeah, you don't see this mech very often now, do you? When you, uh, when you think back, how often do you see the summoner in matches? So, yeah. But as I said, if you haven't tried it, give it a go. It is a fun mech. Um, it's it's got it's got its own little quirks, so it makes it kind of unique to play. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you have a good week, and I will uh, I'll catch you next time. I'll uh, try and get that epic stance dance video up uh, for the for the Tuesday that I mentioned, uh, amongst other things, bunch of law warriors. So yeah, have a good one all. Um, see ya. Bye. Bye bye. See you about. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you about. How do I end these?